The next strike, still with an open hand, is called a C strike. So if you hold your hand like this, you can see there's a, a natural shape C. Some people say it looks more like an L, but I want you to imagine this is a C. This is going to be the area that you strike with. The target will be the throat. So we're going to strike the throat with the C. So you can quickly feel it on yourself. If you strike your own trachea with your, with your hand, that's quite painful. Now imagine if you employ the principles that you've just learned. Bringing the strike all the way through your knee, all the way through your hip, all the way through your shoulder, and you pull with the opposite hand and you strike that throat. How much pain will you be able to inflict? I think quite a lot. Now this strike has, has a little secret to it as well. You're not going to fight like a chameleon, so you're not going to try and hit somebody like this. This is a surprise strike. So the guy's in close proximity to you, and he's putting his head against you, or he's grabbing you, his chin is down, meaning that it's very difficult to strike straight forward. So you bring it all the way from the hip, so it's, it's a lower type of strike. You bring it from, from the hip, and you strike upwards, and you hit that throat area. Again, the idea is to strike as hard as you can, to penetrate, to go right through. So that should be the picture in your mind so that you inflict maximum injury. Let's illustrate how that looks if it's done against an attacker.